I met the father of my children at a family event. I mean, he was very sweet. He listened. He was like very careful. Like he was, he was amazing. But things change, I guess. Everything was like totally fine up until the point that I got pregnant. I lived with him and his family for four years, and it was just like a constant yelling back and forth. When he got upset, he took it out on me, and I didn't want that. I definitely didn't want my children to see that. I did think about leaving a couple of times, but I never really shared with my family, like, hey, this is what's going on. So when I did leave, which was about a year ago, it was just too much. If I'm going to do better for myself and be happy, I need to leave. A while before like I even thought about leaving, I got involved with Community Health Action. Right after I left the house, I went straight to them, and they found me a DV shelter, domestic violence shelter in Brooklyn. When I took those EEP classes, which is the Economic Empowerment Program, I finally felt like I was myself again. I was just blown away. I was just blown away because here I am four months, four and a half months pregnant, I'm in the shelter, and the program itself was letting me have an opportunity to move on from the situation I'm in. They gave us the necessary skills. I am now certified in Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Outlook. I know how to dress, I know how to talk. So I know the right way to present myself in the corporate field. And right now I work at one of the top New York City law firms and without EEP, without sanctuaries, help, period, I will not be where I am today. The best thing to do is to reach out to somebody to know that you're not alone. It's not okay to accept any type of abuse, whether it's physical, whether it's verbal. It's okay to get help because you never know in the long run that help can actually change your life. And I just can't wait to find out what's next in store for me because I'm pretty sure Sanctuary will be walking with me along the way.